How many commuting options are there from Hoboken, New Jersey? A lot. Here we are in Hoboken Terminal today. We're gonna to take you on a tour of all the different options that commute in and out of New York City, into the suburbs. Some of them originate here, some of them pass through here, and other ones around town. Give you a really good idea of all the options that you have when you live in Hoboken, of how you can commute to work, how you can get to see friends and family, how you can get to the shore, and do all the things that people in Hoboken love to do. Here you are at probably the most popular commuting option in all of Hoboken, the Hoboken Path Train. Right downstairs, there's a few different tracks you can pick up that get you into Midtown Manhattan, Lower Manhattan, the Financial District, Downtown Jersey City, and even back into Newark. It's a great option for commuting into anywhere in the city, really. It makes you feel like you're just part of the subway system, like you could jump in and out of anywhere in Manhattan, in Brooklyn, and Queens. And the fares are reasonable. They're about the same price as a subway. You actually use the same Metro card that you would use once you get into the city. So it's just a great option to give you that connectivity, that easy commute back to the city. Here you are at the New York Waterway Ferry. Ferry is one of the best ways to get in and out of the city for a daily commute. It's a little bit more expensive. It's about $300 a month or $18 a round trip if you're going to take it once in a while. But it's six, seven minutes right across the Hudson River. Beautiful ride. Days that it's cold, it has it inside, but on the nice summer days, it has a top deck and you can sit outside and really enjoy the, the ride across the river. We're at the Pat Station train station downtown location. That's one spot the ferry comes into, into Hoboken. But on the other side of town, up on 14th Street, there's another stop. And it gets you into a couple different locations in the city. It gets you into Midtown, gets you into Lower Manhattan, gets you into Battery Park. So you have different options depending on where you're going. And the cool thing is, too, once you get there, there are shuttles and buses that run you to different parts of the city and run some loops around different areas that are popular for people to be commuting to. So it's a really, really convenient way, a really, really fun way, a little bit more expensive. And the cool thing is like walking through the ferry terminal, look at these awesome like 200 year old beams that we have here. This is like throughout Hoboken, right? There's so much cool character, so many cool old school features that we really get to enjoy on our daily commutes to and from work. Here we have New Jersey Transit trains. The New Jersey Transit line is an extensive platform that can get you anywhere you need to go in New Jersey, and you can access that entire train system from here. There's about 10 different tracks here. That is, this is the terminal in Hoboken. So many lines start from here and end here. People use this to reverse commute if you're going to other areas that are, you might live in Hoboken, but might be traveling to other areas for work, like a Newark, like a Westfield, like different areas like that. Or people use this to get to the New Jersey shore quite often. It has a line that goes all the way down the shoreline, all the way to all the major beach towns that people want to get to. If you don't have a car, jump on the train on a Friday afternoon, skip the traffic, and you can be at the shore in time to relax for the weekend. Just steps away from the New Jersey Transit train terminal, we have the Hudson Bergen Light Rail. Now this is a more of a local train. It's gonna get you into Jersey City, a couple different stops. It's gonna get you all throughout Hoboken. We're down at the Path Station, train station area now, but it's gonna stop on 2nd Street, on 9th Street, and also go into North Bergen, into Weehawken, into uh, almost all the way up to Edgewater. And it's gonna also go the opposite way into Bayonne. So you're gonna have real local Hudson County transit here, really easy to connect right back to the train station that can get you out to different areas that you need to go as well. Here you have the Hoboken bus terminal. We are at the southern end of town where the line starts, but the great thing about the 126 line is it goes all the way up through Hoboken to the north side of town, makes a quick turn and into the Lincoln Tunnel into Midtown Manhattan and Port Authority, where it's one of the main commuting hubs in New York City. There's other bus lines as well that go throughout New Jersey, into uh, Jersey City, Bayonne, all through Hudson County and beyond. But the main purpose of this line that most people for commuting purposes use is to get into Manhattan. As you go up down, up and down Washington Street on this bus, it stops every two blocks or so. It runs every few minutes during commuting hours. It's a really convenient way to get in. This is only $3.20 to get all the way into Manhattan from anywhere in Hoboken. If you want to bounce around Hoboken, it's only $1.80 to do something in town here. And it's a little bit longer, 20 minutes, 15, 20, 25 minutes, depending on where you pick it up. But it is economical versus the ferry, that six, eight minute ride right across the river. So another great option everyone in Hoboken really enjoys. One of the really cool additions to the commuting options that we have in Hoboken now, this is about two or three years ago, the city put in these city bikes. They go back and forth from Jersey City into Hoboken, over into Weehawken. There's stops all over the place. There's about 15, 20 stops in Hoboken. The really nice part too is they operate through the Lyft app. So you don't need a separate app for it. If you use Uber or Lyft, you can use that to un unlock these bikes. They have battery powered ones, are a little bit more expensive. And then regular ones, if you need a little bit of a workout, and they're stops at all the major, major commuting spots, right? Like right now we're down by the pass station. So you can take them anywhere in town where they store the bikes overnight, where they reload them in the morning for you. And then you can shoot right downtown, drop them off here at the pass station, jump on the path, jump on the ferry, and you're right into the city wherever you need to go. Walking is a great option, but if you have a little bit less time and you need to get there a little bit quicker, these babies really are awesome. 
So that's it. These are the reasons that Hoboken is one of the most commuter friendly towns in the whole country, quite honestly. We hope to see you on one of our buses, one of our trains. If you have any other questions, feel free to reach out. Have a great day.